In today's video, we are going to look at names or spices in Chi and make sure you stick to the end as I'll be sharing with you some bonus tips. Have you ever watched or looked up a food recipe and got unsure on how to get those spices in Ghana? Well, here are some names or spices in Chi that will get you to lay your hands on them spices for that special recipe the next time you want to make it. These are known as Dadwamba or Pepper and they also add a burst of flavor to foods while helping in the body's digestion. All right, a few of its health benefits are that it relieves constipation and reduces nausea. Moving on to the next, I'm sure we all have heard about this before in Ghana. I mean, you go to the marketplace and you hear of Akukomesa. Yes, so Akukomesa is the tree name for the spice basil leaves. And when you add these to your fruits, you have the most amazing and sweetest aroma you could ever, ever, ever dream of inhaling and it's also known for relieving constipation and reduction of stomach gas and we have the turkey berries now turkey berries are very rich in iron and vitamin c which can be found in its leaves making it extremely good for pregnant women and its tree name is cantosi anise seeds anise seeds are known as inketinkete in tree and these seeds contain thymol, terpenol, and anethanol, which are good at relieving coughs. Consuming anise seeds will help you improve your digestion, reduce nausea, and alleviate cramps. The African locust bean. African locust beans are known as dawa dawa in tree, and this kind of spice contains the minerals riboflavin and thiamine they are often used for medicinal purposes and usually used in soups stews and many others in Ghana scotch bonnet pepper the scotch bonnet pepper in Ghana is known as papushito and it's used in soup and stews here in Ghana as well and it has a taste a little less hotter than chili that's depending on the amount of pepper you use in your kind of delicacy Aden fruits the Aden fruits is known as Prakesa in Ghana and when it's bent in a pot like incense it gives off a sweet aroma it aids in blood flow and eliminates blood clots it also has anti-inflammatory properties some even say it's a symbol of power. Grains of Paradise. Other names for grains of paradise include alligator pepper or guinea pepper. Its tree name is a formosa and it has a characteristic pungent flavor. It is also used for its antimicrobial and aphrodisiac purposes. Potash, also known as potassium carbonate and in tree known as kanwu or kanwe besides its chemical use in industries potash is used in the preparation of wache which is a mash of rice with beans in wache potash raises the texture and induces easy digestion it's also used as a substitute for salt food thickener and food tenderizer mint leaves known as nunum in tree these can be chewed raw or included in meals or remedies it is rich in nutrients and known to improve brain function it also helps in masking bad breath and decreases pain during breastfeeding negro pepper negro pepper is known as ahwentia or printia in tree this spice has medicinal uses due to its microbial properties. When used sparingly, it gives a nutmeg-like taste, but in excess, 
a rather bitter one. The spice is best used in soups, stews and cornmeal porridges. West African Black Pepper Its tree name is Estorobisa. What is unique about this kind of spice is that its leaves can also be eaten. It's not as hot as the others and when it is used in minimal quantities it has a clove-like flavor in soups, stews and cornmeal porridges. If your spice is of high quality, it would have a strong fresh aroma.